And Britt, that's all in sport. Great, Ebony. Thank you very much. Still to come, all your weather details. Then the working man's club goes pink for a cause. It's the place with Morris Store. The village has it all. Get the things that you want. Anything that you need. Get it here at Strat Village. You get it all together. It has been a cool but mostly sunny start to the week across Sunraysia. Taking a look at today's details, Swan Hill reached a top of 23 degrees after an overnight low of 10. Ogan was also 23, but slightly cooler overnight, 8 degrees. Mildura and Robinvale, 24 degrees. Now to the readings and at 3 o'clock this afternoon the air pressure was rising, the dew point was minus 0.2 and the humidity was 20%. And checking the river heights, the Murray River was falling at both Walkall Junction and Boundary Bend. On to the satellite picture, a trough over eastern Queensland is producing showers and severe thunderstorms while thick cloud over Tasmania near a deep low is also bringing showers. Patchy cloud over southern of Victoria is in moist. Southerlies is only producing the odd light shower, but skies are clearer in the north as winds dry out over the land. And on the synoptic chart, a low pressure system over the Tasman Sea will move away to the southeast later tonight as a high pressure system develops over the bite. The high will gradually move eastwards on Tuesday, crossing Tasmania on Wednesday. The high will remain on Friday with a weak low pressure trough expected to move into the southwest Victoria on Friday night. To the forecast for tomorrow. Robin Vale, a top of 26 degrees as well as Bell Ronald. Ogan, slightly warmer, 27. Swan Hill, also 26. So in Muldura, there will be a low of 10 degrees before reaching a sunny top of 26. Turning to the capital cities in Melbourne, it will be 21 degrees with a few light showers, while in Adelaide, it will be partly cloudy, reaching a top of 24. And to the outlook, skies will stay mostly sunny across the region, with temperatures heating up later in the week. And finally tonight, Mildura's Working Men's Club has gone pink to help raise money for the McGrath Foundation during the Ashes Test. While the cricket was played at the Sydney Cricket Ground on Saturday, Sunraysia residents got into the spirit, raising funds at home. Staff at the workers were decked out in pink for the special event and even the bar area was an all-pink affair. Patrons donated to the National Fundraiser and enjoyed a number of raffles throughout the day. And that is how we saw news in the region today. Please join us again tomorrow night for Win News, your local news. You can also follow us on Twitter and Facebook. Thanks for your company this Monday. Have a great evening. Good night. been a Win News presentation from Win, Australia's number 1 regional television network.